Kea back again with another vlog. This one, um, I feel like a lot more happens in this one in my life, although I do have to apologize that pretty much all this footage is from late September and early October. I've been very busy and a little bit behind, but hopefully you'll enjoy it. I don't feel like I have too, too much to say today, um, so I feel like I'm just gonna sort of let you see what I've been up to. gonna do another jump just gotta set up the camera because I'm gonna be doing a jump with someone else it's gonna be fun if you're alive <laughs> Well, I did it. Jumped in. Felt great. Been having a good time here. It's kind of nice to just hang out with people and have a couple drinks and eat good food and just be out in nature again. It's nice. It's really nice. I, I really can't wait to move next year and just be living in the country full time. That'll be amazing. Really excited for that. Oh, they're coming. I gotta go. <laughs> I wonder if praying mantises have made it out here. Probably. Well, you say probably. I don't know, maybe. You wanna see a big girl pup? Well, that guy's grumpy. So, as usual, I found a plethora of bugs and other critters. Uh, but I found some very exciting stuff, so definitely keep watching. I really love to watch bugs pollinate. Ah, it's very, like, therapeutic to me. So this here is actually very neat. Uh, these ants are in nuptial flight, so they're sending queens out 
so they can start new colonies. You actually get to see one of them fly away in, in a moment. It's pretty cool. I also saw a zillion mushrooms. I got so much mushroom footage, I, I couldn't even think to squish it all in this one video. So if you want to see a video that details to a degree all the mushrooms and whatnot that I found, let me know in the comments down below and I'll make a video. I still have all the footage. Here I'm just picking some leaves for my isopods back at home. Looks like a little fairy lives in there or something. This guy is the largest wild salamander I have ever found. Look at how chunky she is. She might be like 20 years old. She's huge. Absolutely fell in love with this little guy. Look at it. Oh my gosh. And don't worry, we absolutely put her back and tried not to disturb her home too much. It's a magical moment though. And we also found about a million of these guys. At, uh, definitely at least a few hundred. And we also found a skink. This is um, Ontario's only native lizard. So I was really happy that we managed to find one. I find myself struggling to not play with every puffball I find. The water is completely filled with tannins from all the leaves breaking down. It's really beautiful, actually. Probably kill. Yeah, look at that. Orange.
happening. We had some pretty delicious uh, snacks up at the cabin too. These wraps were something else. Oh my gosh. And Jen, of course. have less things on my shelves so I can find myself a little bit more willing to actually keep it clean. I feel like dusting everything is one of the things that actually helps me feel like I'm in a clean environment. And if there's 20 million things on here, then it's a lot harder to convince myself to clean it. So I've been disposing of a few things. We also got some new Mastic Proctus for vinegar runes. They are very fantastic. I am absolutely in love with all of them and we've actually managed to successfully pair a couple of them so I'm hoping to have some babies. At least in the spring we'll probably have some babies. But they're nice and fat and healthy and very very excited for their future. We also got the cats some new blankets, and Odin was very eager to get in them. Would it even be a video of mine if I didn't show myself cooking something? It's just a good portion of my life, so... Here we are! I don't think I was feeling very well when I was making these, but that's okay. I'm a little better now. Recently, uh, after, the, after this vlog, I, I dealt with a lot of pretty bad health issues. My... Uh, Anemia has been quite serious, although I've managed to supplement and kind of get a little bit closer to baseline, I'm still not doing super well, so, well, hopefully things will get better. I mean, yeah, they already are getting better, but it's, it's very exhausting and hard to get stuff done, hard to convince myself to do anything. Luckily, the Twitch streams and working in the vlogs have sort of helped me feel like I'm doing something. And you guys have been so encouraging, so just thank you very much, everybody who's here. And I guess just thank you, everybody who's watching my content. And if you're still here, um, thank you again. <laughs> I hope that you enjoyed this video, and I hope that you'll stick around for whatever I put out next, because I have a lot planned. So, yeah, I'll see you later. Have a good day.